let me give you a little tour of my camping setup. This is my 2008 Ford van. This is what we use to pull the camper. I have a little bit of cabinet space for food and whatnot. I have a refrigerator, a sink with more storage underneath it, and a rechargeable water spigot. And my fishing equipment. And if I had to, I can lay an army cot down here. And underneath that cabinet is storage and a five gallon water jug, kind of like these ones here. That's what we get our water from. And there's my camping setup. We're camping at conservation ground, so we have no electricity. I can run a generator. Right here is my solar power system. It charges that little box there, kind of like a solar generator, 100 watt. It'll run a couple fans and a TV at night. There's my porta potty, canopy, camper setup. That little box on the front with the orange and black wires running out of it and red wire, that is for my solar system for the camper. Over here, I have two 200 watt solar panels for a total of 400 watts. And there's my camper. Nothing fancy, a little pop up. My son Reese playing underneath there, propane tank. And outdoor stove, three burner stove. And it can also hook up inside. And inside I have a, I guess you'd call it a king size bed back here. The table, it turns into a bed. And again, I have a sink. Stove would normally sit where that round dish and plate is at. Underneath the sink, I have more storage. There's some cereal. There's also a five gallon water jug underneath there for our electric water spigot. And there is my air conditioner. That couch also slides out and turns into a bed. And then we have a I don't know if you'd call it a full size. It's bigger than a twin, but smaller than a full size. TV, fan. There is my power inverter to run off my batteries when I need to at night. And there's my son coming in to see what I'm doing. Little hanging baskets for some supplies. Like I said, not a bad little setup. That air conditioner seems to work pretty well. I don't remember how many BTU it is. Um, I know it says it here somewhere. If you can see it there. It keeps the camper comfortable. I wouldn't say it'd run you out from cold, but it keeps it comfortable on hot summer nights. Well, that's my little setup. There's the exhaust for the air conditioner. Little DeWalt battery powered speaker. Also use it to charge the bones. And there's King Lake. This is where I'm spending the next four days. That solar system I showed you earlier, 400 watts, is it's not enough to run my air conditioner. So I need to get some more solar panels. I'll probably mount them on top. And I'm going to get some solar panels and a rack to mount on top of the van. So I have at least 400 watts in there. And then I do have the 5,000 watt generator.